So we continue on um, to talk about situations when you're on the ground or you may end up on the ground. So we spoke a lot about um, loss of balance, particularly with footwear that you've got on. So loss of balance is quite uh, a high potential. And if you end up on the ground, it's very important we understand what we should and shouldn't do on the ground. Well, if you were to land on the ground with the hard concrete, you're going to be pretty dazed, pretty shocked. So what we're going to look at is a position we can adopt on the ground to keep ourselves as safe as possible, to continue to defend, to defend ourselves if we need to, but also um, to, to wait and decide when it's the most safest time to get up. Okay? So Maggie's on her back and she'll turn slightly over to one side, so her left hip is up into the air. You'll notice that she's got her foot turned on an angle, protecting the groin area and putting the foot towards the knee and her hands are up by her face. A very dangerous situation is a standing opponent, okay, so someone standing over and you're at a lower level than them. What you don't want to happen is, don't do anything, what you don't want to happen is that this person gets around and can get to your head. Okay? Because unfortunately in the head, when you're around this position, your head is there, horrible things can happen to your head. So based on being in this position then, if I'm standing over to Magda, the reason her foot is turned on the side is because can, she can use the foot to keep me away. So striking strongly towards vulnerable parts of the body, towards the knee joint, towards the groin, whatever. So she can use one foot or the other foot, whichever she decides to do, in order to attack. Again, you notice the heel, her heel is turned to the outside. The same on the other leg. Her heel is turned to the outside. Why? If her foot is vertical, then she will probably miss the target, especially in the dark as well. The target being the knee. If I turn the foot, more surface area to hit with. Hitting with towards the knee and hitting towards the groin. Hands are up all the time. Her elbows are off the floor. Hitting your elbows on concrete, not great. Okay, rounding her back slightly, using the back muscles to protect herself. If you know she's trying, trying to really cover herself as much as possible, so if I was trying to reach over and hit at all, it would be very difficult.